Hello, welcome to daily art day number 2850. I got a lot done on Pocahontas here. I think her face is maybe getting a bit dark. So, gonna have to fix that up. Probably maybe one or two more sessions just on her face alone before I get to the rest of her. But I like the way it's coming along. Very, very soft and smooth, kind of ethereal looking. That's intentional very different from my normal drawings, but everything has its own purpose, really. Um, I, I, bring, I, I come into a drawing with a new idea and trying to describe this ancient Native American. Uh, so not much to talk about today except for focus. Uh, yesterday I really didn't focus well on art, didn't spend a lot of time on it, so today recognize that and put a lot of effort into making sure that I focus, focus, focus. Just listen to some music while I was working, got the time in, and wow, it was really, really amazing just to be able to get some deep focus in on work. It seems like I can get so much more done in so little time. You know, one other thing that I want to talk about, I'm going to go over here to my <laughs> stack of drawings. I usually, um, I'm hanging them up right now, uh, but I figured out yesterday, you probably can't see this on the phone. I'm a bit particular on, on, on this anyways, but now you can kind of see it here. On this drawing of um, Fred Rogers, you know, I use these clips, these big clips to, you know, kind of clip and hang them pretty easy to do you don't have to worry about tape or anything and I'm kind of worried about the tape residue but the problem I have here is these clips are pinching too much into the paper and leaving uh, indentations so I'm trying to figure out a way to clip this paper so I don't leave those indentations see I got one right here I mean it's really minor I think most people would never see it but it's important to me so I'm working with different ways of actually hanging my drawings until I can get them framed. Uh, and yeah, I could probably put them in a flat file somewhere, you know, be really careful with them, but I like them up. I like being able to look at them, reference them, uh, especially the bad ones, the ones that I haven't done very well. Those are actually closer to my desk, so I can see them all the time. It's your bad drawings that you learn the most from. So. The tip today, the three tips today, when you're drawing, when you're doing something very important to you, focus, go into deep focus. The second tip, <laughs> be careful of these clips. Depending on the paper you have, it's a bit, if it's a bit thick paper, it's gonna put indentations in them. And the third tip, your worst drawings, actually these aren't the worst, I have some ones that I've already thrown away, but your worst drawings are always going to tell you something. You'll learn more from your mistakes than you do your successes. But the successes are awesome too. So anyway, have an awesome day. Keep creating.